Hey guys, welcome to my latest video. Uh, today I thought I would focus on the eyes and I am very much feeling the spring weather. So I thought I would feature the Static Palette from Motives and let's talk about fun flirty eye makeup. So this is more for everyday wear, uh, daytime appropriate, but it's gonna be bright, it's gonna be fun and we're gonna feature this palette so you can see there is pinks and purples and warm tones and then there's one black color to really shade it out so I figured let's have fun uh, I've already done my base I've already put on my blush and I'm actually wearing this lipstick that I'm somewhat obsessed with so this is new from motives uh, it is the bear me duo so it comes with a liner and it comes with a lipstick and I'm just gonna pop this on. It's on pretty well, but yeah. Mm. So that is the lipstick and I am somewhat obsessed. I think it's great. So we are going to start and the brushes I'm going to use today are going to be from my Tri Beauty Box subscription. And these are the crown brushes, oval smudger, chisel flush, uh, fluff and what's this one the round angle blender so and then this is the brow groomer i uh, or lash if you need to separate your lashes but uh i figured i would go through these with you because these are the ones that i carry um in my studio and i like to use them for my makeup lessons so we'll try these ones out okay now the first step is to use the eye base so i'm using the motives eye base and I like this one because it is flesh toned uh, and a little goes a long way. So if you use too much and it's white and powdery, it's too much. Um, it really should be invisible. So I'm just scooping some out and I'm gonna put it on my finger. My hands are clean. Um, I did wash them before starting the video, very important. Um, so I'm just going to smooth this out between my two fingers and then uh, uh, uh. put this on my eyelid and I'm gonna smooth it all out and I'm gonna come underneath just a little with the end so and I am using my ring finger as your ring finger is your weakest finger and you don't want to be pulling or pushing too hard on your delicate eye area so I'm smoothing that all around. All right, now to start, I don't really have a plan. <laughs> I never have a plan when I start with these videos, but um, uh, I always try to go from light to dark or a halo eye or something like that. So I'm going to start with my crease with my round fluffer brush and I'm going to start I think with this one in the crease it's called attitude um, so I'm gonna dab a bit on the brush you can see that is super vibrant and I'm gonna just come in the corner of my eye and then do my windshield bringing it inward And then this is great to keep the eyes open so you can really see your crease. Grab a bit more and the other side. And then I always want to match. I'm just really blending back and forth. Cool. Okay, I love that. I am going to go in with my chisel fluff. It's a bit of the bigger flat one. And I'm going to start with the fever on the outside. And then I'm going to switch over to... Pandora for the middle. So I'm gonna stick with these ones. They kind of look like semi-matte shadows. We'll see. 
I always turn my brush upside down and I really press it in and wiggle it about. So I'm really working on getting this color into the uh, skin, really making sure they're married to each other. Oh my gosh, this is an intense color. Oh, I love it. Um, the pigment payoff is amazing with this palette. Um, yeah. <laughs> That's fun. Holy smokes. Wow. And I'm just going to come back with my chisel to just kind of shade. I'm going to just flick back and forth, get off the excess pigment, and then I'm going to come in with the lighter shade called Pandora. I love how easy these are to blend. That is amazing. So I'm gonna go in with Spell. It's this color here, you can see it's super shimmery. I'm gonna really highlight my inner tear duct area. Um, I really, really, really wanna I love how that looks. Okay, fantastic. Um, now I'm gonna add a little bit, there's a bunch of uh, super shimmer, so I've used that one. And I think I'm gonna come in with Hardwired, it's a little bit of a light shimmer. And uh, I'm going to just tap that on kind of the middle or inner third part of my eye and I'm going back to my medium sized, what is this one again? chisel fluff. Nice. So I'm going to go back with this brush, the small oval smudger, and I'm going to start smudging underneath my eye. So I'm going to start, I'm actually going to go with Wrecked. Um, this corner one. I'm gonna just clean this off. And I'm gonna take Wrecked and I'm just gonna gently smudge my under eye. Um, and I'm gonna take from this spot, bringing it up. And by doing it that way, I'm actually going to give myself a bit of an eye lift or an illusion. Do the same thing on the other side. And that can just really enhance the eye shape. And then I'm going to go back to Pandora, which is the light pink color, and I'm gonna just do the inner third of my under eye. Just very lightly brushing back and forth. There we go. All right, so now I'm actually gonna pick up my eyeliner and I have the Black Magic um, Waterproof Automatic Pencil from Motives. Um, it's my summer pencil. So I'm going to just come in here and with my eye open, I'm just going to trace my lash line and I will eventually smudge this out But I'm just going on my natural lash.
Okay, so I don't have an angled brush with the crown brush set, but I do have this, it's called the Superhero Brush from IT Cosmetics, and I'm gonna use the liner end with my um, smoky, what is it called? Oh, Void, my black black eyeshadow here. So I'm going to do this on the top lash line and blend it with my eyeliner and yeah start to make it a bit more contrast. There and the other eye. And I'm just gonna do the outer uh, under corner, just a smidge. All right. Then I'm going to set my lash curler to curl. <laughs> and wait for it to heat up. And we're gonna curl the lashes. And I'm going to use my Fiber Lash Mascara from Motives. And I absolutely love this mascara. It is one of those fiber mascaras, which they're pretty awesome if they don't flake. And luckily Motives is one that does not flake. So you end up with monster lashes. And really, if you're using the right mascara, you don't need falsies. Um, this just gives an amazing thickness with just enough depth. There we go. There's one eye done. And I am just gonna do a little bit on the lower lash line very gently there and I'm gonna get a little bit more in there for the next eye And there we go. Uh, it's very bright, it's very playful, and why not have a little bit of fun with your makeup, right? So if you have any questions, please comment below and let me know what you think. If you wanna see different types of looks or any questions really, please just comment below and let me know. And I hope you subscribe and I hope you enjoy of the videos. <laughs> Thanks guys. Bye. I can feel my body. Your folds against the concrete. But I can't seem to get enough. My mind is fixed on what it wants.